To Man Bradley in Boston, where you are right now, nobody can relax, I imagine. There's a police order for people to stay indoors. First the marathon bombs, then the shock, and then a shootout with suspects. How are people reacting? What are you hearing about? Adrian, it is a remarkable scene to see here. The entire city of Boston is on lockdown, as well as the suburbs. Millions of people are being affected by this. It is an unprecedented police operation underway. Law enforcement officials say they don't recall seeing a situation this tense in many, many years. Uh, where we see helicopters flying above. We see state police out and about. We even have the National Guard on the streets. It is an absolutely uh, breathtaking seen. There's nothing been quite like this perhaps since 9-11 to see this type of police presence. What about the suspects' origins and possible motivations? Two young Chechens in the U.S. and they're described as armed and dangerous? These brothers were heavily armed. They were firing explosives at law enforcement officers. They were shooting guns. Uh, there was a shootout. One of the suspects was killed. Uh, the other one got away, and law enforcement uh, are continuing the manhunt for them. We are trying to find out more information about them. President Obama and his administration uh, are, are looking into their backgrounds, are trying to find out if they have any ties to international terrorism. Right now, that information is still not known, Adrian. Taman, your president said after the attack on the race, we're going to find out who did this and why. Why did they did this? Uh, surely not looking for any justification but a cause, right? It was unusual, Adrian, because right after the attack, no one claimed responsibility. Usually, when you have an act of terror like this, someone comes out and says, this is my work, this is my job. Apparently, these two individuals did not do it. And law enforcement here, in fact, used the public uh, to help them to uh, locate them. They put out surveillance images that were captured during the marathon of the two individuals. Uh, that information was made public late last night and then they were in pursuit of these individuals just a couple hours later, Adrian. Uh, to Man Bradley in Boston, thanks for bringing us up to the minute on the tensions there.